Wow, we haven't played this in a while, have we, Matt? Woo-wee, no we haven't. But the difference being, I want to play as a certain character. Ryan wants to do an Azazel run, because that's a really cool demon, and it's fun to play as. It's fun, you can get far, it's just, it's just overall just really fun. He looks badass, too. I love, I love his design. You can fly on rocks. Yeah, you can fly over everything, that's like, so overpowered in the beginning. But you got, you only got those, uh... What are those called? I, I, dude, I haven't played this game in months. I don't know what those hearts are called. St uh, stone hearts? Or black I just call hearts them or whatever. Something. Black hearts, white hearts. I'll call them black hearts. Who knows? That's Let's see what item we're gonna get, dude. It's a spider. She it's loves a, me. She runs around. She's having a good time. Look at her. She's cute. So you know how Jesus is a Mexican name? Yeah. Do you think any, like, white person has tried to name their kid that, but just named him Jesus instead? Wait, is there a law against naming your kid Jesus? Uh... Because I know that there's like laws, there? so you can't name your kids certain things. Is, is it Jesus just out of manners them? people don't? Uh, I don't know. Some some guy named his kid Adolf Hitler, apparently. There has to be someone who named their kid Jesus. Like a, very, like a religious parent that's like, I want my son to grow up reflecting the values of Christ, so yeah. uh, here, here's little, little boy Jesus. Hi, I'm Jesus Smith. Jesus is my favorite. Jesus is my friend. Jesus is a friend of mine. Seen that video? Uh, no. It's like a, it's like a nice oh, little band. Boogie me. Look boogie at all this you? fire, dude. Boogie you? You want me to call Boogie, uh, 229 it up? And 2988? Two, what two, is two, it? 229,000? Two, two, boogie actual? over 9,000? Why is this guy black? Dude, I don't know. I don't question race. I don't see race. I'm colorblind. I don't see race. Those, those people are my favorite types of people. I don't see race. Are you fucking blind? No, it... Dude, I'm blind. What the hell? I literally don't see race. <laughs> yeah, it's just like that. Are you oh, blind? I just remember. Wait a second. We were at a, a, a rotating sushi bar in Little Tokyo, and we got seated. And the server like went outside to call the next person, and his name was Jesus, and she just she was like Jesus. <laughs> I know. Jesus. Jesus. And then the guy walked in with his girlfriend with a puzzled look on his face, and he was Hispanic. She was hilarious. She called him Jesus. If you're like an adult, how do you not know that that's Jesus? No one is named Jesus. Matt, I think you're just being a little rude. What do you mean of being a little rude? No, who names their kid Jesus? You may one day, who knows? You may think God may come to you in the form of a spider and say, <laughs> Matt, <laughs> name your next kid Jesus. He's the second coming of Christ. I'd say, okay. Okay, oh, if you, if you bitch. Ryan, if you saw that, let's just say you're in the elevator one day. Okay, just in an elevator? Or? Sure, just anywhere. I'm, I'm just setting up a scene. You're in an elevator and there's a little itsy bitsy spider on the wall. And he speaks to you and he says, I am God, your son, you need to have a son. He's going to be the second coming of Christ. How would you react? Would you would you think you're going crazy or would you legitimately believe that it's God telling you you need to name your son Jesus? That's a tough one. Because if you name your son Jesus and you tell people like, yeah, God came to me in the form of an arachnid and then uh, told me <laughs> I need to name my son Jesus to commence the second coming of Christ, no one's gonna believe you. And they're just gonna think your your friends and family would stop being friends with you because they're gonna think you're crazy and you named your son Jesus. Let's see what this does. I turned him into poop? I guess so. Damn it. I, I don't know what it did to the floor. I'm rushing Whoa, into shit. Whoa, dude. You're, you're, uh, shoot your beam. Oh, never mind. You got rid of it. What? This? Uh, when you have that, it makes your, uh, your beam, like, see? Ooh, that's interesting. I just remembered another story that has to do with the name Jesus. My what is cousin, it? when my cousin was a, uh, he was in like third or fourth grade, he had a pet turtle. And, um, and, uh, my mom and I went and bought him a tank for his turtle. And on the inside, it had a little manufacturing tag that says manufactured by. And his said manufactured by Jesus. But it was funny because it looked like it said manufactured by Jesus. But it wasn't manufactured. No, by it was Jesus. manufactured by a Hispanic man named Jesus. <laughs> Oh boy! Who's this guy? Who is this? He's he's fun. I don't oh, know he's got name. he's got a little boy. He's, he fires beams. Oh. oh, he's almost dead though. You got him. got him. You got him. Damage and range up. I need more hearts. Damn it. Yeah, that sucks. Whatever. I'm good. You're not gonna go in the Satan room? No, I have no hearts to spare. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I do, but I'm not going to. Yeah, you just need to get like an HP up, uh, power up, and then once you have an HP up, then you can start getting more lives. Ah, uh -huh. yeah, the little worms. Those worms are cute. They don't want to hurt anybody. Except for when they shit on you. Yeah, it's pretty fucking gross. Ooh, Ooh you get a little ghost buddy. What's he do? What's he do? 
Oh, yeah, this is the one that, um, I think it mirrors something, right? Oh, it mirrors my movement. Yeah, 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 it follows your path. Okay, that's good. Give me something cool. Aww. Uh, nope, nothing. Doesn't that up your luck? I don't know, I would hope so. It does something. People in the comments, let me know what that does. Anybody coming, please? People in the comments, please let me know. I miss playing this game. This game is so much fun just to like chill out late at night. The and challenges play. are fun too. Oh, the challenge is super fun. If people like this, uh, then we can play some of the challenges on the channel. I like watching it. I think it's so much fun to watch. It's because I'm a big, I'm a big boy. And you're, I think you're good at it. I know that people on YouTube are very good and they are very specific about it, watching people play this game, but I, everyone plays differently. I like watching you play. I think it's a, it's fun. Oh, thank you. Emergency contact. Emergency. What does that do? I don't know. Pine a multiplier? Oh man. What's that exactly. spider do? Does it just lay little bombs? Here we go. Let's see if it this fucks me over. Expl oh shit. Oh. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh, God. No. No. God. <laughs> Let's go. Gertie. Oh, this will be easy. Gotcha, Gertie. Oh. oh got, got hurt by a fly. I didn't see the fly. Oh. You got hurt by uh, Damn it, something Gertie. else. A little old lady who swallowed a fly. I don't know why she swallowed a fly. Perhaps she'll die. It's such a it's such a fucked up like. Why are most nursery rhymes and children's tales fucked up? Like Rockabye Baby. That's about putting a baby at the top of a tree and then the wind blows and it falls to its death. I don't know. London Bridge is about it like burning down or something. Ash. It's about dying. Ashes. You know, it's ashes. About ashes the we all bubonic fall plague. Down. Yeah, the bubonic plague. And then God like. Damn it, dude. Why can't I get any health up, bro? I don't know, bro. I'm sorry. I'm on the fourth fucking dungeon. It's Just give me some health, up. bro. You're I just want a red heart so I can refill it. You'll probably find some here. And then that, that nursery rhyme I was just talking about, that's pretty messed up too. We're all messed up, man. I wonder why. Was there a point to making like, them so fucking why, Like, they're for children. Why are they so morbid? And, like, the kids don't realize the that they're morbid. But, I don't know. To adults, they're morbid. Maybe they weren't to made kids, for they kids. They just sound like fun little rhyming pieces of shit. Maybe they were made by adults for like protests and gonna continue to do this. just things to spread around. Whoop. Oh, jeez. See ya. I'll see ya. Get out of here. Wouldn't want to be ya. Mm. I'll see ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. <laughs> okay. Sure, I'll use a key to get in here. Yeah, uh, you could have just floated right over it. I could have, but uh, I want to. I want to at least. Uh... Woo! Oh, nice. Does that do anything with the attack you have though? <laughs> Tears up. Maybe it. You have to charge my time? tier damage. I don't know. Wait a second. I think tears up ups your fire rate. Um, I get that heart, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Got a soul heart. Put some coins in there. It's almost at 69. <laughs> now it is. <laughs> That's so raven. It's the future I can see. That's so raven. It's so mysterious, mysterious to me. I like that. That's so raven. I got so many little buddies helping me out. Oh man, I've watched people like, uh, there's a YouTuber named Northern Lion, who special, like, his specialty is playing Binding of Isaac. And I'll tune in every now and then to just one of his, like, more recent, uh, Binding of Isaac videos. And I click on it, and I'm like, what the fuck is going on? He'll have, like, five people following him, this ridiculous skin, he'll be in some place I've never seen, like, shooting ridiculous beams of shit. <laughs> ridiculous beams of shit? What does this do? That's a power-up. Edmund McMillan, if you're listening, Holy put shit, ridiculous look at all these beams of I shit have. in the game. Whoa! Sorry, anyways, what's your message to Egg McMillan? Egg McMillan. Egg McMillan. Alright, Egg McMuffin, if you're listening, uh, you should put an item in the game called Wonderful Beams of Shit, just for me. You're welcome. You're welcome for that idea. You're, thank you, Matt. He's a cool dude, the guy that developed this game. I love his art. Uh, he did Super Meat Boy, and also he has a new game called The End is Nigh, which I'd like to play, but it looks really hard. It looks like Super Meat Boy, like, style gameplay. Looks very difficult. It's kind of like a gothic Super Meat Boy. This guy got a. Nope, he just doesn't want to. Turn your back to him for a while. What's he doing? Dude! There you go. <laughs> gotcha! The spider blew him up. Mega fat. Oh, this boy. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, watch out for this one. This one's a troublemaker! Get him! Oh, thank God. You got him. Okay, that, that's HP. Yeah! That's breakfast. Now I have a red heart. Yeah, so it, not not all is bad. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. I had this PE coach in high school, and we played dodgeball, and every time someone would get out, she'd go, See ya! 
She got real mad at me and my friend Gavin because we always used to fuck around and uh, kind of like we'd always uh, we pretend to be gay with each other and that really upset pretend her for some reason. With each other? I don't know. Like, Why'd you pretend? Oh, we'd suck each other's dicks in front of her and it would really bother. That's not her. pretending. She'd go. She'd go. Don't do that in my classroom. No, but we would always like. I don't know. We freeballed it a lot because it was funny. And uh, sometimes you pull the like stretch little ball skin out of your gym shorts and be like, oh, I got gum on my shorts. <laughs> oh, good, Matt. Not to the teacher, <laughs> just to just to the other people. It was funny. And then um, oh shit, dude! I just remember what we did in PE. We had a locker room with cages in it, and um, we did this thing called a uh, freshman Fridays, where we get the freshmen and make them fight in the cage. Only if they like, we didn't force them to. Only like they thought it was funny. Uh, because I guess they wanted to impress the upperclassmen, so they would do it. And, um, there was this big, big, like, very large, uh, fat guy named Frank. And he, and he would, he'd get in the, in the cage, and there was some kid that was kind of scared of doing it, but he was like, I'm gonna do it anyway! And he got in, and then we sent Frank in and shut the door. Oh god, one of them turned into a real fight once, it was pretty scary to watch. They were, like, slapping each other really hard. Did and... someone die? Well, no, it was because, like, there was a big, uh, muscly guy, and... Got another friend. Ooh, nice. You got a whole, the whole gang's all here. You got a, uh, my, my friend was like slapping him around in the cage, because that's the point. But then the big, like, muscly jock actually got mad. And you could tell, like, he's like, uh, trying to actually hit him. <laughs> I, I fought in the cage once. You fought in the cage? I did fight in the cage. It was very did fun. Did you ever do slap boxing in the bathroom? Slap boxing? What's slap boxing? Uh, you go to the bathroom, and instead of real boxing, it, it's, you slap. You, oh, you just slap each other? Yeah. Another fucking buddy? Oh, who thinks their arms are long enough to slap box? Look at all these From, friends. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit, how many do you have? One, two, three, four, five? <laughs> but, uh, we did this thing in dodgeball where I would get in my friend's shirt and stick my arms out of his sleeves, so, like, four arms were coming out of his sleeves, and I would have two dodgeballs, and then he would have two dodgeballs, he would throw them, and then he would grab the other two dodgeballs from my hands. So it was, uh... What's this? It was like we were invincible in that game. Man, there's just a whole crowd following me today. You got a whole gang of friends. Um... Oh, you go oh yeah, you here. float so those don't hurt you. I got real scared. Oh wait, hold on, let me Oh, try fuck it. these guys. Never mind. Oh, I just... What? Whoa, whoa! What does that do? What's this? It's like a big Love turquoise love? orifice. Let's see. Can Let's you go see. down it? I don't know what that does. And what's that thing in the middle? Is that one of your buddies? No, it's like something that I could put in place of the thing that changes the shape of my whatever. Oh, nice. Okay. Fuck. Blowing up spiders left and right. Woo! I would love some more health, though. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, I mean, you've, you've been doing this on three hearts, and two of them, when they're gone, they're gone for good, so... Oh, jeez. Get them! Get them! Get them! Whoa! Oh, Too bad you can't get any fuck. of this! That's a cool room, though. Hey, well... Yeah, I mean, it's pointless. Never mind. I was about to say, if you get more health in this level, you can go back there, but if you get more health, it'll up your hearts, so it's pointless. You know what stupid, else is pointless? Stupid. What? Are you going to say D's nuts? Maybe. Is that what you're going to say? I don't know. What, what were you going to say, Ryan? Th what do you think Ryan was going to say? Leave your answer down in the comments below. Fuck this guy. Oh, Monstro? Or Monstro 2.0? Yeah. He's a fire in his laser. What a good old meme. Shoop de whoop. Ah oh, man, that was one of my first memes. Shoop de whoop. Yeah. Baby's first meme. I'm trying to think back to my very first memes. The Link CDI game where it was like, <gasps> my boy. Ooh, is that? Ooh, HP up. You got HP up. Okay. Oh wait, go back to the heart room because you. Have well, half I want to go in there fill. first because that will take you to a new place, I think. Because yeah, but like I'd rather. But don't you want to go get just a but heart? I'm afraid of this will disappear if I leave the room. All right, we'll go in then. <gasps> Whoa! If you take that though, what do you mean? Do you have keys? Oh, you can get all these hearts too, unless you can float over those. Oh fuck! Oh damn it! I didn't even touch it. Hold on. Well, this was pleasant. Ooh! What a pleasant Ooh. surprise! And now go back and get the other heart. Well, I'm gonna get this first. Does that take something from you or do something? No, no. Remember, it adds a heart when you complete the level. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, now you can drop down. See ya. See ya. Oof. Oh, Oof. damn. Oof, who's uh -oh. that? Oh. Mom hears a little sperm cell speaking in the attic going, Please 
please don't squish me. My please mom, don't drink me. My, my mom's always doing that. Don't drink me. Damn, dude, you have a lot of life. Do the, don't the soul hearts, when you when you lose one, it kills everyone in the room, right? Yes. Okay, then you're on your... You're oh, on that's track. Mine. Whoa. Wait, I think it like connects to other enemies. Whoa, really? I don't know. Cause what the what's going on there? Cause see how is it, it Yeah, like, I see it. It like it, it'll extend or change. Maybe it's a dang glitch. Fucking glitch. Dude, she's a glitch. Is that, <laughs> that in Spy Kids? Yeah, that's in Spy Kids. She's a fucking glitch, dude. I like that picture someone made where it was like when you're running out of topics to talk about on Super Fuck. Mega. And it's me dabbing my forehead because I'm sweating because I'm running out of topics. And then there's four buttons. It was like Spy Kids. Um, dude, I don't remember what the other ones were. But the other ones won. What's your favorite Bible story, Matt? Mm. What Bible story when you were young you actually enjoyed listening to? Jonah and the sperm whale. See, that was mine. That was always a classic because it reminded me of Pinocchio. It's just because it's so, like, crazy and fun. Whoa. My God. Oh, so you have an enemy that poisons people, or a little buddy that poisons people. And now I got Did another you get another one? Yep. Oh my He's god. A turret follower. One, two, three, four, five. Six. What does that do? Something in there? What happened? Just took me to this room. Nothing's in the poop. Uh. I feel like there's something. Like if you place a bomb or something on one of these at the end? Might blow you to a new room? I don't know. Uh. Oh well, whatever. Whatever, dude. F it. <laughs> Such a, like a middle school. F it, dude. F it, dude. I remember one time when I was in middle school, I was hanging out with a friend, and I saw some guys uh, going near one of my bikes when I was in the woods. And I just clearly remember saying to my friend, dude, excuse my French, but if they take my my bike, then bitch. Wait, what? It was one of the first times I ever like tried to swear. I still remember to this day. You got it, dude. You're gonna kill mommy. She's almost done. You're, you're, you're taking a lot of damage, but she's almost dead. I really get can't it, tell it. what the fuck is, like, my friend or foe. <gasps> Another room! That's how it is in Hollywood, baby. That's how it is in Hollywood. I'm, I'm drowsy? Sure, okay. Okay. What's in here? Ooh. These things will shoot at you, I think, and you can't kill them. What's this do? You have been blessed. Whoa. What does that mean? I don't know. Look it up, Matt. Okay, give me a second, please. Okay. Let me look it up. Look it up. I want to know what happens when I'm blessed. Binding oh, it's the cool level. Of Isaac. Matt, it's our favorite. Blessed. Oh, it's the womb. Do I have another friend? When did I get this guy? You've had six, remember? No, this guy that's shooting stuff now next to me. You've always had that. I don't remember. I saw it earlier. S wait, you had it. Did you have... Was it called scapular? What? Yeah, here we go. I got it. What does it do? It, uh, creates a bright aura around Isaac's head. Whenever Isaac is lowered to one half of his last heart container, the aura around his head temporarily vanishes, and he is granted one soul heart. Aw. Okay, cool. So, that'll help us out when you're almost dead. It's pretty cool, I guess. It's pretty cool, I guess, but F it! Ah, dude, F it! Dude, this game is so fucking metal, bro! I'm sick of this effing junk! What are you talking about? I'm sick of this ish. Woo! I'm sick of this freaking ish, dude. Oh, that was dumb. What the freak is still my favorite, like, what middle school What the freak? Story. What the freak, dude? I burped in the middle of saying that. That's why it sounded so fucking weird. <laughs> it sounded like a squatch call. Do your squatch calls, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I would pay, like, just to get you on one of those, like, Discovery Channel squatch hunting shows. To go in the woods with them and do your squatch calls at night. <laughs> Damn, that sounds like a Squatch if I've ever heard one, and I haven't because they don't exist. Okay, now that's, that's conjecture. That's conjecture, my friend. You don't know if that's true. You don't know- <laughs> have you ever not seen a Squatch? Have you ever seen a Squatch? You just- you just can't what tell the with fuck? these things. Whoa. Those I don't like this. nerve endings. Whoa, get- oh shit! Uh, wow, your health is down to three hearts, by the way. Woo! Something's killing me. That- the oh, poop, it's the, the poop. poop! I'm touching the poop, Don't fuck. touch the- you have one heart left! Uh... Blow up the poop. Uh... Okay, uh, no, Oh, that still... chest had spikes on it! There's still stuff in there. Shut up, Matt! I'm trying to focus! Sorry. I can't focus if I'm stepping in shit, hitting a spiky chest, I'm and I have sorry. seven friends, fuck it- Damn it! 
<laughs> you touched the poop. If you didn't tell me to go back into that room, everyone. Because you left all the treasures in there. Find Matt and kill him. 